Welcome to our FB page at sa ating YouTube channel na Pareho Solving Math with Leonalyn. Again, yung FB page natin na Free Reviewers Managed by Leonalyn, di tayo maka-upload mga videos dyan, kaya dito na tayo sa ating Solving Math with Leonalyn na FB page. Now, let's answer question from random post at ito ay nakapost sa ating FB group na Philippine Civil Service Review for All. Ito yung post. Alam nyo ba na minsan na itong lumabas sa mismong actual na exam dati? Yung ganito yung tanong na dividing by kung ano yung number dyan, yung decimal, is the same as multiplying by. Okay. So, dito muna tayo. Paano ba ito? Unang-una, itong 0.5, gawin nating fraction. So, paano gawin ng fraction itong 5? Kopyahin lang yung 5. Sa baba, maglagay ka ng isang 1. And then, yung number of decimal or i-move natin yung decimal to the right side. So, once lang din naman. So, isa lang yung 0. Now, hanapan natin ito ng greatest common factor para masimplify, which is 5. So, 5 divided by 5 and this is 1. 10 divided by 5 and this is 2. Now, dividing by 0.5. Ang 0.5 ngayon, yan yung 1 half. So, divided by, instead na decimal na 0.5, divided by 1 half. Now, division of fraction. Diba sa div division of fraction, yung uh, dinidivide natin, bali, kopyahin lang. Example, itong si x, kopyahin lang yan siya. Now, sa division ay magiging multiplication, reciprocal nito ay 2 over 1. Si 2 over 1 ay pareho lang din naman na 2 lang. So, therefore, ang sagot dito is the same as multiplying by 2. Another example para mas lalong maintindihan. Dividing by 0.25. Gawin muna nating decimal itong 0.25. So, kopyahin si 25. Yung denominator maglagay tayo ng 1. And then, i-count natin yung decimal kasi i-move natin going to the right side para maging whole number itong 25. So, 1, 2. So, twice tayo nag-move. Therefore, dalawa din yung 0 ilalagay natin dyan. Now, i-simplify natin yan by finding the greatest common factor which is 25. 25 divided by 25 and that is 1. 100 divided by 25 and this is 4. Now, dividing... Dividing by 0.25, instead na 0.25 ang i-divide natin, or pang-divide pala, 1 fourth ang gamitin natin. So, divided by 1 fourth. Example, let n para sa i-divide dito sa 1 fourth. Sa so division of fraction, kopyahin lang yung i-divide natin. Yung division maging multiplication, reciprocal ni 1 fourth ay 4 over 1. Remember, lahat ng may denominator na 1, automatic whole number kasi yan siya. Therefore, ang sagot ay the same as multiplying by 4. Now, we have more examples. So, I hope by this time, kaya nyo nang sagutan ito kung paano ba na example na nandito sa atin ay dividing by 0.2 is the same as multiplying by what? Kopyahin ulit natin si 2. Maglagay tayo ng 1 sa denominator. I-move natin yung decimal going to the right side para maging whole number itong point 0.2 natin. Once lang tayo nag-move, kaya isa lang yung 0. Now, kailangan natin yung simplify by finding the greatest common factor, which is 2. 2 divided by 2, and that is 1. 10 divided by 2, and this is 5. So, therefore, gamitin natin itong 1 fifth. Divided by 1 fifth. Now, example, yung dinivide natin dito, let n para sa number na yan. Sa division of fraction, kopyahin lang ito, ang division maging multiplication at reciprocal dito sa pang-divide natin. So, magiging 5 over 1. So, 1 lang din ang denominator dyan. So, pariho lang din na whole number yan siya. So, therefore, ang sagot ay i-multiply siya ng 5. Another example, dividing by 0.125. So, kopyahin si 1, 2, 5. Maglagay tayo ng 1 sa denominator. I-move move ulit natin itong decimal. 1, 2, 3. So, tatlo yung 
mga zeros na nasa baba. And then, hanapan natin ang greatest common factor para masimplify natin yan at ang greatest common factor ay 125. 125 divided by 125 and this is 1. 1,000 divided by 125 and this is 8. So, obviously, kung napapansin nyo kung ano yung denominator dito, yan na yung pang multiply. Again, dividing by 0.125 is the same as multiplying by 8. Thank you for watching and all I hope meron kang natutunan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.